Nigerian singer and former member of the Plantashun Boys group, Ahmadu Obiabo, better known as Blackface, feels that it's about time to end his long-time feud with Two-Face Idibia. He recently guest-starred on the latest episode of the The Honest Bunch podcast, where he spoke about his relationship with his former bandmates Chibuzo Oji, a.k.a. Faze, and Innocent Idibia, popularly known as Two-Face. Blackface stated that after the group split in 2004, he and Faze have been on good terms, but not so much with Two-Face. The entertainer said that he was ready to settle the issues with Two-Face and has forgiven him. He also urged his former bandmate to do the same. It is time to bury the hatchet. Forgive Two-Face for everything he has done to me, knowingly and unknowingly. You better put it in your mind to forgive me because I have done nothing wrong. Give you anything you've done to me. Oh. And anything I've done to you, unknowingly or unknowingly, you better put it in your mind to forgive me because I don't know it wrong and I know you know what I'm talking about. So it's time for us to go to the next level. I want to make everybody know this one. That's another one talking for my language, make everybody know too, be like, say, how they go down. Mm. But it is time to bury the hatchet. Mm. It is time to forget all these things that have been going on. I'm not saying this on the point of view that it is because I want to get the Plantation Boys money. Yes, yes. I want us to go on tour and we get money. Mm. I'm okay. I'm, I'm good. If you stay now, no one will sing again. I go still do okay. Because my royalty is good. They still do real. Yes. Anyhow, I go to manage. Small, mm, small, they mm, go. Mm. But then we need, to, we need to get to the fans. And we need to, we need to sanitize the world. See yes. the wars where they go on. Yes. The war, the Gaza. See the wars they go on. And I know you know what I'm talking about. It's time for us to go to the next level. Blackface said, ever since the group split up and Two-Face went solo, he and Blackface have been at loggerheads because Blackface claimed that he wrote the song, African Queen, which was a hit single from Two-Face Idibia's debut solo album, Face Two-Face. Since then, Blackface has consistently called out his former Two-Face over various issues, including copyright infringements. Things took a turn for the worse after Blackface called him gay in his Dias track war released in 2019, after which Two-Face filed a lawsuit against him seeking N50 Millen over defamation of character. On top of that, their issues became even worse in 2014, when Two-Face released another single called Let Somebody Love You, containing lyrics written allegedly by Blackface. Blackface then gave his conditions for their issues to be resolved, stating that Efe Omorogbe, Two-Face's manager's name, be taken off the song. Now, years down the line, he is ready to bury the hatchet. Wow.